All right, I've heard from a few people that today's digits was difficult. This is the newish game from the New York Times where you're trying to do math equations. And uh, I'm gonna give it a shot. So we've gotta use these six numbers to make 58 somehow with the different operations. And we'll have five different numbers we have to do eventually. We're starting with 58. So uh, let's see, I mean, seven times nine is 63. We would then have to subtract five, which would be uh, 10 divided by two. So let's do that. 63 minus five is 58, there we go. Next one, 199. I mean, the obvious thing to do is to try to go to 200 and subtract one. Um, we do have eight minus seven, which is one, nine minus eight, which is one. So a few ways to get one, but how do we get to 200? 200 is 25 times eight. So there we go, 25 times eight, but we can't make one now that we lost our eight. That's the tricky part. Um, so, let's see, we can still maybe get to one. Yeah, we can. Five plus seven is 12. 12 minus 11 is still one. So, just a little bit more of a roundabout way to get to one. Okay, the next one, 201. So again, get to 200, add one, seems like the obvious thing to do. Uh, now that would be 20 times 10 would be 200. Uh, can we get... I don't see a great way to get 10. There's probably a way. But then we'd still have to be able to add one too. So maybe that's not a good plan. All right, well, 15 times nine only gets you to 135. So we would then have to add 66. So that's not great. Um, let's see, 20, 20 times 9 is 180, we would have to add 21, and 21, 21, uh, 15 plus 6, 11 plus 10, hmm, <laughs> no, I don't think that really works, uh, I'm not seeing a good way to get to 21, 7 times 3 is 21, but seven times three, how do we get three? I mean, we can get three with seven minus four, but then we've used the seven, so we can't then do seven times three, right? That's the problem. And you can get seven with 11 minus four, but if you're doing seven minus four to get to the three, then... Um... We can do 8 times 20 if we do 15 minus 7. We can get 8 times 20. That's 160. We would then need 41. We can do 44 with 11 times 4. 41. You could do 36 with 4 times 9, but... We can also do 11 times 20, which would get us 220. And then we'd have to subtract 19. Yeah, and 15 plus 4 is 19. There we go. That'll work. Okay. On to 333. Three, three. Well, I mean 111 times 3, right? We've got an 11. If we could get 11 times 10, <laughs> that seems like it's not going to work out very well. I mean, we could do 11 times 10. So, we can do 9 minus 7, which is 2. 20 divided by 2. Oh, I know. People want me to to do these, not just do it in my head. Uh, 20 divided by two is 10. So we can then do um, 10 times 11 is 100 and, oh, that's just 110. We wanna get to 111, actually. But then we'd have to multiply by three anyways, and we can't do that, so that doesn't really work. That was just my first thought. Uh, so, so, um, I mean, 20 times 25 is 500. It feels like that's gonna be too big. 13 times 25 would be 325. Let's try that, see if we can get, so we would need another eight. Can we get eight somehow? We've got 16 and 19. 20, we can do nine. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Look at this, we can do 20. Minus 11, 9, 
divided by nine, which gets us one, seven plus one is eight, eight plus 325 is 333. There we go, all right, and I used all of the numbers, which is kind of fun. Okay, and finally, 421. So, I mean, 18 times 10 is only 180. It feels like we gotta get pretty, pretty, pretty big initially to get up there because I mean, our, our biggest numbers isn't even gonna get us very close. Uh, 18 times 12 would be 204, right? No, 18 times 12, it's 18 times 12, 216, sorry, 216. I, I missed a 12. <laughs> uh, oh, I know what I did wrong. Yeah, 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 because I, I, took, I took 18 times 10 that I'd already done 180 and I added two 12s instead of two 18s, that's why. I did that wrong. So 18 times 12 is 216, but you still need, I mean, you need a lot. That's uh, 205 you still need, so. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't know. I don't think that's gonna work. So let's do something like, what do we wanna do? We could do like 10 plus 11 is 21. We could do 21 times but 21 times 18 is gonna be too big, isn't it? No, no, that's not too bad. That's not too bad. Let's, let's, let's do. Let's see. 21, uh, 21 times 18 gets us 378. So we're 43 away. And oh, we can do 42. Five times six is 30. Plus 12 is 42. And we need 43. So close. Uh, and 12 times 5 is 60, minus 6 is 54. Okay, so that doesn't work. But, we're getting there, we're getting there. Let's do, let's do 10 plus 12, which is 22, times 18, which is 396. And now we need to add 25. 25, and... <sighs> Can't quite get 25. I don't think. Yeah, we can, yeah, we can. 11 minus six is five. Five times five is 25. 396 plus 25 is 421. There we go, all right. And again, we used all the numbers. All right, very nice. Those were a couple of tricky ones, especially the last two I felt like were pretty tricky. Um, the third one was a little hard too. The first two weren't bad. Um, yeah, I, I mean, sometimes it just depends if you happen to kind of think along the right lines, you know? Um, but there you go. So let me know if you had a different solution than I did on any of these and which one you thought was the hardest and be sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you again soon with some more puzzles. In the next inning, he was on deck when the manager informed him he had just been traded to the Montreal Expos. Now, the Expos oh, had a oh, game oh. later that evening. Replacement. I was just thinking about words that could end with M-E-N-T. Oh, it's not so one of the L's has to be the lie. So feel or feeling, I think feeling, because I think it's gonna be develop, or maybe develops with the S there. 